yeah, our next speaker is Mr. Jainul Abidin, who is a science student and also startup enthusiast. He is from Deen Dayal Upadhyay Gorakhpur University. Mr. Yes, Abidin. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Good morning. Go ahead, Good evening, Abhiyal. Thank you for giving a chance to set up my idea on this level. I would like to draw your kind attention on the topic unlocking India's potential in the space sector. As it is well known that India's potential lies in its youth, which mostly belongs from schools, colleges, and universities. Firstly, I would inquire, like to inquire that how can we connect the students' community with the real life space time projects? and reduce the gap between students' knowledge and practical space education. My second doubt is, sir, if a uh, space enthusiast student wants to initiate uh, their own startup while he is uh, uh, college university, does he have any existing scheme to support them, provide them any mentorship? If yes, then up to what extent for it? And how should they approach them in on ISRO fund? My further question is, sir, how can this help in generating awareness and realize the importance of space in our daily life huge? For, further, I would like to inquire, sir, does ISRO have any plan to, to offer projects to college students, students so that it can build inter interest in them about the space sector? If yes, will there be any stipend for him? Also, what will be their qualification and selection procedure in it? Uh, consequently, more and more little junior alumnus will be immersed from our Indian institutes. Finally, I will be conclude my questions. How can we implement a motto? Space science is in every field and for everyone. Thank you all for giving me an opportunity to share my views on this topic. Unlocking India's, space, unlocking India's potential in the space sector. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Mr. Abedin. We take your slogan, Space Science in Every Field and Everyone, which is actually in synonymous with our vision and mission, as said by Dr. Vikram Sarabhai. We'll come back with the answers to your questions comprehensively at the end. Maybe when uh, Dr. Venkatakrishnan is summarizing, your queries will get addressed appropriately. Thank you, ma'am. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.